that started a petition to save Silver Lake Pool. The group says the pool is valuable to the community. It serves a diverse population, including eight different community groups that reach underserved populations. Mayo Clinic doctor Michael Joyner is helping to lead the effort. His first job was actually as a lifeguard at his local pool growing up. He does still put that on his resume also. Dr. Joyner says the pool provides opportunities for people who might not get them elsewhere. He says the group's ultimate goal is to collaborate with the city to not only ensure the pool stays open, but to collaborate with them on other activities too, like track and field. Whether it's running, uh, uh, aquatics, anything, swimming, uh, other sports where we try to make things more inclusive and reduce barriers for participation and develop a vibrant plan going forward so that, that you know, this medical mecca can also be the healthiest city in the world in terms of recreational opportunities for all. The cost to get the pool up and running is about $40,000. Dr. Joyner says that they do have some support from Mayor Norton and other city leaders. And we can expect to know a decision the first week of May. And almost 1,000 people have signed the petition so far. If you want to know more about this, I'll have this all up at KTTC.com. Back to you, Jess. Thank you. And Sarah,